What's going on, good people of YouTube? This is Sean with Future View Gaming, bringing you an uncensored and unscripted commentary about weapon balance and destiny. First off, the montage coming soon, probably the next month or so. Second off, video, I'm using the Luck in the Chamber Irene. Yeah. Why the fuck not? <laughs> but, as I say that, uh, makes a good backdrop. I'm glad Luck in the Chamber got the recent nerf that it got. I haven't played Destiny much since that patch, so I have no opinions on the newer one, but yes. We're going to talk about a time in Destiny. There was balance. Can you believe it? Yes, there was actual gun balance. The Suros regime was great. Overpowered? No. Great? Yes. The Thorn? Great. Overpowered? You had counters to it, so no. Last word was great. Would you believe that the Thorn and the Last Word were just as good in the earlier renditions prior to their actual buffs? They were. They were amazing. They were still two-shot kills. But Bungie decided to buff them and nerf the shit out of auto rifles. You don't nerf and buff in the same patch. That should be common sense. By nerfing something that's considered great and buffing something that's considered bad to being great, you just basically replace one with the other. <laughs> I mean, what kind of logic is that? I shouldn't even have to make this video. Like, that should I should just send that statement to Bungie and see just what they think about it. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, at this point, everything was pretty decent. And then the auto rifle nerf came. That nerfed them into oblivion. To be another slap in the face, they released Pest Control Matrix... The wolf's claw or whatever the fuck that thing was. See, I don't even remember what it was called. Because auto rifles were nerfed to oblivion. But some really good ones, what could have been good, came out with the House of Wolves. Are you stupid or something, Bungie? Come on now. Anyways. Yeah, you, you, you get where I'm going with this. Now, the Taken King. Oh, yay. The Taken King's coming out. We're going to buff Pulse Rifles even more. Yay. Oh, and Thorn and Last Word are getting a nerf. Then some genius is like, hey, let's nerf all of the hand cannons. Fucking idiot. And the way you nerfed them was stupid as fuck. Let's give them random bullet deviation after the first shot. So when someone shoots with them, they have a 50% chance of hitting. You're an idiot, and you should be fired. Literally, the guy who suggested who suggested this should be fucking fired. I don't give a fuck if I don't do his job. I would probably do a better job than him. Next up, let's see. Um, yeah, not with the Nova Bomb. <laughs> you know, um, uh, it's, it's hard for me to say what pisses me off more. And then they try and patch everything. They're like, oh, we're going to make the hand cannons more accurate again. I haven't played with them since to see how much more accurate, but... There was one hand cannon that was still prevalently used. Yeah, people still use the last word a little bit, but it was shit. I don't care what you say. To me, it was shit. Inconsistency is shit. Hawkmoon, shit. But people still used it. And it was still considered a good weapon. Oh, we're going to nerf the Hawkmoon after we buff the, uh, the hand cannons. Great job. Tom, Ted, Bill, Danny, whatever the fuck your name is. Great fucking job with that idea. Why? Because it's actually used? Because people actually like using it? You're fucking stupid. Whew. Okay. I'm calm again. Alright. Now, the biggest problem with the Taken King was, again, the buffing and the nerfing, like I said. Then Trials of Osiris comes out. What's the meta for Trials? Everybody knows this. Pulse rifles and shotguns. Yeah, you have maps where you can snipe on them. But in most cases, pulse rifles and shotguns. Then they use maps that are mostly shotgun maps. So pulse rifles and shotguns. There is no real decent counter to the shotgun anymore since Thorn and Last Word got their major nerf. There's no consistent counter to them. So shotguns were at a state where they just, they were king. Up close, you couldn't do nothing against someone with a shotgun. You could literally spray whole clips into people, but because of the shitty coding and the way this game is done with peer-to-peer -peer connection, the lag. And the lag was in the favor of the shotguns every fucking time. 
you could put a whole clip into somebody if the first burst didn't actually register, you were fucked. So, yeah. Gun balance. Did it exist? No. <laughs> Why? Because you nerf and buff at the same time. Oh, let's nerf the thorn, but we're going to buff the pulse rifles. Why do they do this? Because they listen to the community. I understand listening to the community for quite a bit of things, but on your weapon balance, just because a bunch of people, ah, I got killed by Thorn, <laughs> doesn't mean you have to completely obliterate the entire class of hand cannons. I mean, I love my Red Hand 9. It was my go-to legendary. If I wasn't using Thorn, Last Word, Might of Multi-Tool, Bad Juju, Red Death, I would use the fuck out of my Red Hand. I loved that gun. It was so good. And yeah, mine had Luck in the Chamber and Final Round on it. It was like kind of like a Hawk Moon in a sense, but it was, it was great. I loved it. <laughs> so... I didn't see the point in the blanket nerf. It was just like with the other rifles. They nerfed the entire class simply because of Soros Regime. You know, if you're going to nerf anything, nerf what's overpowered because it's overpowered. Don't nerf an entire category because one or two culprits. I'm sure there's a bunch of YouTube videos with people saying the same thing, but it's something that's been on my mind quite a bit lately. And I'm like doing my montage and stuff I'm watching clips of me I have Trials of Osiris clips I'm having to edit down and I'm watching them and I'm like yeah I should get this guy he should be dead headshot 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 Hawksaw um, Red Death Bad Juju Reflection Some and not too many times I'm seeing people just jump through it with shotguns and I'm like, there is no fucking weapon balance. And don't even get me started on the matchmaking for trials because you fucked up bad when you made it to where it's not really connection-based or skilled-based. It's based on people who are on their way to the lighthouse and they're closest to it if you're closest to it. That's fine, but do some kind of limitation to the connection. I'm sick of facing red bar motherfuckers. <laughs> like seriously I think I'm not the only one who has that complaint now I'm just saying Bungie could get their shit together and I could give you some ideas of how to fix your weapons send me an email send me a fucking message on YouTube do whatever I'll tell you exactly what you need to do to balance this game <laughs> granted it's only my opinion anyways Hopefully you guys didn't get too bored with my ranting and enjoyed the gameplay in the background. It was fairly entertaining. The montage is coming soon. I'll be uploading that as soon as it's done. And maybe some more videos will become more regular. Anyways, have a good one, YouTube. If you agree with me, leave it down in the comments. Drop a like. And if you haven't, subscribed. It's free. It's not hurting you or anything. <laughs> Alright, people. Y'all have a good one.